And that breaking news tonight, just in the last hour, we've now learned that two teens are now accused of murdering a well-known Indianapolis doctor. Dr. Kevin Rogers was found shot to death inside his Eagle Creek home last month. Our crime beat reporter Steve Jefferson has been covering this story since Rogers was killed. In fact, he broke the news of the arrest in our air and on the WTHR app. Steve is joining us live tonight at 6. And Steve, what are police telling you about this ongoing investigation? Well, they're telling me there could be more arrests, Andrea. The two teenagers under arrest tonight are most likely, again, the first two to be arrested in the murder of Kevin Rogers. One of them is 18-year-old Karan Bigman Hurst. He's charged with uh, murder and felony burglary. The juvenile is likely to face the same charges. On November 20th, the wife of Dr. Kevin Rogers found him shot to death in their northwest Indianapolis home. I Witness News learned early on from sources that the murder happened during a botched burglary. Homicide detectives believe the two teenagers broke into Rogers' home that morning, not realizing he was inside. Rogers died from multiple gunshot wounds. Rogers served as an assistant coach at Cathedral High School, and he was a program director emeritus for Indiana University School of Medicine. Eyewitness News has also learned that the Homicide Detective Unit, they have strong evidence in this case that led them to the two teenagers. This is an ongoing investigation, so we may see even more arrests in this case. Detectives has questions several people in this case, including a Pike High School student who was pulled out of school during their investigation. We'll tell you more about those pending and possible arrests coming up on the night beat as we continue to follow this case. Back to you in the studio. All right, Steve, thank you. And again, to recap exactly what we know tonight, two teens are now facing charges in the murder of Dr. Kevin Rogers. Rogers was killed inside of his Eagle Creek home on the city's west side on November 20th, right before Thanksgiving. Now, the teens are facing murder and burglary charges. Again, we're trying to get more information about the moment leading up to the shooting. And we also have another crew working on this story as we speak. We'll, of course, be sure to send out any new updates on the WTHR app, on social media, and tonight on Eyewitness News after the Colts game.